Hello, my wonderful viewers. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on your location or anytime you are meeting this video. If it is your first time and you like what I do here, after watching this video, I want you to subscribe, put on your notification bell to all notifications. That notification bell is very, very important because it will enable you to know when we upload a new video in this platform. So this is a requested video. I have made this video several times, but it seems a lot of people do not understand it. Somebody said I should explain what um, doom doom um section 6b or paragraph 6b what does it mean now i'm going to be explaining it and uh, if you think this video is for you please watch it especially those of you who are living under this doom doom you should pay attention and know the meaning of what you are carrying some of you will come here and watch for two minutes and go away then when you fall into trouble you will understand so now a foreigner who is enforceable obliged to leave the country shall be granted toleration within the meaning of Section 60A as toleration for person with unclear identity. If the deportation cannot be carried out for reasons for which he is responsible because he has overcome the obstacle to deportation through his own deception establishes his identity or nationality himself or by providing false information himself or he fails to take reasonable steps to fulfill the special obligation to obtain a passport in accordance with paragraph 2 sentence 1 and paragraph 3 sentence 1. The foreigner is to be issued with the certificate of toleration pursuant to section 60A with the addition for persons whose identity is unclear. Now, what does it mean that Dung Dung section 60B is when your identity is not clear for example you come from another country and you claim that you come from another country and now when they want to deport you maybe they don't have your uh, passport they don't have clear information about you you may say you come from uh, america you come from uh, uh, somali and uh, you don't have somali passport there is nothing that they can use to deport you then they will issue you this dung dung now the foreigner who is enforceable obliged to leave the country does not have a valid passport or passport substitute he is obliged with standing section 3 to take all reasonable steps to obtain a passport or passport substitute himself taking into account the circumstances of the individual case this does not apply to foreigners from the time an application for asylum, Section 13 of the Asylum Act, or an application for asylum, Section 18 of the Asylum Act, has been submitted until the asylum application has been finally rejected. And for foreigners, if there is a ban on deportation under Section 60 or 7, Unless because the deportation ban according to 60 paragraph 7 is based solely on health reasons. Now, in most cases, they will give you this thing to maybe you are sick or maybe your son or your daughter is sick. This thing will be given to you um, until the immense anything that is serving as an obstacle this this thing doesn't mean that sometimes when people have it they think that they have been given document no this is not a document what it simply means that you are due to be deported but there are obstacles either unclear identity or maybe health issues if you have serious health issues like kidney problem liver problem then they may not deport you they will you'll be living under this thing doom until when that image leaves you then they will have ground or reason for example people who do not have clear identity like passport some people do not have passport there's no how they can deport you without passport so they need that your passport so if you get that your quality hold on very well if they see and they will use and carry you go i hope people where i speak this language they understand
Now let's proceed with the meaning of section 2, sentence 1. It is generally reasonable for the foreigner, one, to participate in the issuance or renewal in a manner corresponding to the provision of German passport law, in particular, section 6 and 15 of the Passport Act in the current application version, and to tolerate the processing of an application by the authorities of the country of origin, in accordance with the law of the country or origin, provided that this does not lead to unreasonable hardship to appear in person at the authorities of the country of origin to take part in hearings to take photos upon request and to give fingerprints to provide inferior information or declaration required by the legal and administrative practice of the country of origin or to take other action required by the legal and administrative practice Dear, provided this is not unreasonable, submit a declaration to the authorities of the country of origin that you are leaving the federal territory voluntarily as part of your legal obligation under German law, provided that this issuance of the travel document is made dependent on this. If the issuance of the travel document is made dependent on this, to declare that they will be required to perform military service, provided that compliance with military service is not unreasonable for compelling reasons, and to fulfill other reasonable civil ob obligations, to pay the fees generally specified by the country of origin for the official passport procurement measures, provided that this is not unreasonable for him and to apply again for the issuance of the passport or passport substitute within bounds of what is reasonable and to take the action according to number one to five if due to a change in the factual and legal situation there is sufficient likelihood that the authorities of the country of origin will issue the passport or passport substitute and the foreigners authorities require request him to carry out the action again the foreigner must be informed of these obligations they are deemed to have been fulfilled if the foreigner can credibly demonstrate that he has performed the action specified in sentence one if the foreigner's authority inform the foreigner that his previous explanation and evidence are not sufficient to substitute the fulfillment of a certain action or several certain action according to sentence one the foreigners uh, stop taking the action according to sentence one by declaration to make credible on oath so all these things all these things all these measures is what they want to use to you know bring you back home for people with unclear identity what this uh dung dung um 60 60p simply means that uh, you are for the person that asked me this question that you are due to be taken back but but there are obstacles that is preventing them and they are taking measures they will give you measures that you will take to make sure that you acquire a passport because without passport remember passport is your identity passports um identify where you come from which country identify you that is why anything you want to do in germany you must provide your uh, passport because your passport is you so if people claim that they don't have passport or people misplace uh, their passport so these measures they will refer you to your home country to go and bring another passport People with unclear identity, such as country, they may be sent to do all those promise, uh, uh, these things I read. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, share, and ask your questions in the comment section until I come your way again. Bye-bye.